So I have been deciding to start my vlog for a very long time, and I think like right now will be a good time. Uh, well, right now was 25th November 2015, about two years ago, and I remember this date because it was April's birthday in the evening. And before I share with you the good stuff, which is uh, snippets from the birthday party, uh, let me first sort of revisit this day. So let's get this vlog going. Sitting in the car with. My sister, Monica. No, no. Whatever. Chale, bhaiya. Haan ji, haan ji. Okay, let's go. I remember me and my sister, we had to run a few errands for my mom's new house, and we went to this market. And usually, you know, I don't feel this way. I was spending a certain amount of money for a few luxuries in my mom's house, and then there were these people in the market who were ready to do this work for probably the kind of money we would we would spend on dinner, and that kind of made me feel a little. <laughs> weird about myself you know i don't know what to think about it right? and i went on ranting about it to my sister who was probably standing there and thinking what a baby he needs to fucking grow up anyway moving on i went to meet my senior from school puneet mm. <laughs> then it's a, it's a vlog how come i haven't uh, is it like on facebook if you put a post on it no i haven't started as yet mahale se shuru nahi kita I don't put too many comments and pictures up near me. I'm like active on Facebook, <laughs> but like not very verbal. Not very verbal. Not very verbal. <laughs> Puneet is such a genuine person. In school, I never thought I would know her like this. And she has a beautiful daughter who's so sharp and intelligent. Every time I go to her house, I always am always fed so much good food. But I always need a second lunch. Good or is it good? Good. Mm. So when I'm in Goa, I miss the food in Chandigarh. But Goa itself is such a fun place to be in. It's <laughs> and it's a really funny place to be in as well the most funniest stuff i have seen in my life has been in goa so recently when april and jay came to visit me in goa uh, i took them to the most amazing spot in goa it was this aquarium so this aquarium has like tons and tons of fish like all kinds of fish that you can think about from piranhas to you name it Uh, but for some reason april was really concerned about the emotional health of the fish in the aquarium this one's all alone and has no friends mujhe kiss kar rahi hai i wish i could okay. save it so the aquarium also has a few unorthodox mannequins that you can click pictures with and i'm so glad that i've made this video because no one would believe me without video evidence that these mannequins do exist quite honestly i think it's a genius idea to have a mannequin be on you uh, as you casually exit the aquarium disgusting oh but at this aquarium they save the coolest thing for the last which is the horror show the whole place is creepy <laughs> and I think April had her share of horror, and she walked out. So me and Jay went alone inside. And inside, it was pretty crazy, I must say, for Goa standards. There was like a dinosaur and all that stuff. But the only the only problem was that these things kept flying into your face and kept hitting you. Okay, so as promised, we have reached that segment of the vlog where we get to see April's birthday party. Vlogging. I'm making a vlog. We're gonna be the vlog. My first vlog. I'm making a vlog, so I'm just like recording everything. Can you play some music now? It's on my phone. So then so don't play. make a video. <laughs> I think basically everybody wanted me to shut the fuck up about my vlog. No, he's not taking a photograph. I know what he's doing. Beautiful. And now looking at this footage I know how the party escalated so quickly. Shot shot shot. Obviously it's getting really hot now. Right? 
right in the middle of all of this, April decides that I should speak to her parents. Yamas. Yamas. What is Kismati even doing? She's sitting with like empty plates. Now sucking your stomach, people. Okay, just pay attention to the girl singing happy birthday over here. And before you know it, it was time to click the ceremonial group photograph and this guy had that task of <laughs> executing it. And at some point, my senses kicked in and I realized that I had called a cab to go to Delhi to April's house. Did you tell the driver where to come? Yeah, I just. Did, did you tell him where to come? Yeah. Can we tell them where to come? Did you, did you tell my driver where to come? No. Who did I? April did. And April was like, she's like, okay, right, take a right, take a right, hello. I don't know where he went. So I finally found my car and I was on my way to Delhi and on the journey I was just thinking about friends and life and you know uh, the fact that I mean we are individuals but we are pretty much the sum average of all the friends we have I mean from our social media feed to the way we interact and the things we know and the things we experience you know they're very important they're almost like an extension of your life so it's important to have good friends, it's important to value them and yeah, I guess that's about it. That's about it for this Tuesday. <laughs> Alright guys, thank you so much.